Sam has been talking about these hazy skies here in West Michigan for weeks now. It's been terrible in communities across the U.S. and Canada. Baseball games have been postponed. Major airports have grounded flights and health officials are warning people to wear masks while outside. It looks post apocalyptic in places like New York City. Sam, these wildfires are happening hundreds of miles away. Mm -hmm. What causes the smoke to be so severe? right here in the US. Yeah, so this kind of takes me back to my weather 101 weather basics because we learned this in my introductory classes. What we have right here is called an omega block, Jay. And what happens is we get this structure set up where we've got two low pressure systems and a high pressure system that blocks our weather patterns from moving in their normal stature, right? We've seen that right here in West Michigan. We've seen almost non-changing weather for weeks on end now. Because of this, it's allowed those wildfires to be continuously fueled, meaning they're growing bigger and bigger and then we have what we call the jet stream that moves around these pressure systems right and you can see it moves right through Michigan and then extending back up the East Coast because they have that low pressure system right there junk supposed with the jet stream it's mixing that smoke down to the surface because it gets caught in those upper level winds and for us because we've had no systems moving through our atmosphere we've been so dry we haven't had a cold front or a low pressure system it's not mixing as far down to the surface but that low over the east coast is causing that to happen bringing them that really eerie sight this pattern is expected to continue for a little longer which means we likely will continue to see these smoky effects so the wind both fueling the fires to the north and carrying the smoke all over the US. Yeah, absolutely. The blocking pattern fueling those things because it's keeping it dry. It's keeping it extra warm and there's no systems coming into place. And then we're being fueled by that wildfire smoke. And I actually think next Tuesday when we're expecting that rainfall, we could see that smoke mixed down to our surface and our conditions could potentially look similar to what they're seeing on the East Coast. Any thoughts on how long we'll actually see the smoke stick around? Probably a couple more weeks. Oh boy. All right, Sam. Thank you.